better going right now. But bad. If I meet a female, I would like her to be all those things, especially loyal. It's the most important thing for a female to be. Especially you loyal. Know, yes, sir. Mr. Loyal, man. Oh. We already talked about church. But, but the point is that to initially what? attract a mate, females, the most important thing for them is their looks. Whereas a man, I think, is his status. And status is a far more varied spectrum than looks alone. <laughs> looking alone does not make you a high-status male. To be a high-status male. This base thing is off me. Initially, you're you, just man. pretty, you're going to get attention. Whereas a man, you need to have a bunch of things to just get attention. No care if you see it. Like, not always. You know, like, there's <laughs> men that are funny, that aren't that attractive, that can get attention. It's like an energy thing. I disagree. You disagree? I disagree. Yes, I, I know disagree. He disagree. Attention, but I don't think anyone would look at a funny guy who lives with his mom and call him a high value man. Whereas if you get a really, really beautiful girl, even if she has nothing else going for her, she'd be considered high value. I wouldn't I, say high value, no. Yeah, we can disagree. They are not just a born nigga with glasses. Who is wearing glasses? Indoors, baby. Indoors, baby. Indoors, baby. Indoors, baby. It's fine. Are you a good person? Trust them, man. The best. What makes you the best? Besides you. Whoa! Ibo, I don't like that. Don't often answer questions. Okay. Like I said, besides you, definitely had a place with you in the past. I don't like to answer open-ended questions because I feel like they're a trap. See the veins in the air, because right? when you speak a lot, it's how you end up getting. <laughs> but I had really <laughs> clean, man. Are you telling you, bro? You, you can tell he's greasy, it. Yeah. So he's greased that boy. Specific with your parameters within the questioning, because that allows me to answer them in a way which makes me look the best. I don't know. I feel like a, a very confident man, and very sure of himself, would just answer. Do you think so? Because mm -hmm. yeah. I feel like it's just being confident. Okay, oh. a very innocent man would he just answer the police? Yeah. He's innocent. No, it doesn't mean anything. Innocent and guilty, in and of itself, is a false paradigm. You, you have to understand that the world we live in, there's no black issues. There's, there's no such thing. It's all. But then they don't play around. That's the Peter Pan's two thousand. Sold something to a on eBay seven years ago. Didn't pay tax. Boom, you're going to jail. I'm enjoying this conversation, and I understand every point she's making, and I'm being deliberately abrasive. However, the truth is about the masculine and feminine so dynamics that females like men me. who are completely in charge and... Look at you, I'm looking at me. Exactly what are you looking want, at me? And they comply and bend <laughs> to the man's wills and lifestyle. So you you watch on the, on the right side of the sun, me. me to be so that you like me? <laughs> is, is it <laughs> Look at the flex, just watch me. You see, put me on the fucking yeah, camera. <laughs> yeah, you like this. Like, you get it, man. Flex, now watch me. I know you can look at this watching this video. But he, he flexes so much. And instincts. And tries his best not to hurt anybody. Because she lost an hour of this, man. Are your actions congruent with Wait, your rights? I was yeah. getting up from that table and I was walking away. Oh, that bass kid jump kick this nigga, baby. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a positive man. I'm a positive, <laughs> inspirational man. Look at he's a positive man. <laughs> I inspire people to tell the truth. I inspire people to tell the truth, baby. In fact, I would basically guarantee that 90% of men are lying. They can still stay lying, boy. That's a bit bold. Nigga tell him the gal, he tell the gal he yeah. gonna cheat and he say he yeah. inspired people to tell the truth. <laughs> That's what he's saying, damn with I have you doing up so loud. That nigga gotta do better. Who him, right? But he gotta do better. Hold on, baby, send the word. Women are correct and men are liars. Women are making because they're <laughs> You say women correct and men are liars. Men lie because women You can see it? <laughs> Yeah, I can see it now. You get it? Men are liars because men are in constant competition with other men. You get it, right? And they have to find a way to be competitive. Yeah, I can see it now. Way to be I see hair, but you can <laughs> If you can sit there, you can <laughs> like you're rich because you bought her a hundred pound meal. You could or you can't be. A hundred pound meal. That's what you're going to do. Like, yeah, so boy. Oh, he ain't got no guy he watch on today. He got the different watch on today. He's stupid enough to believe it. Men are dishonest enough to lie. You see how you pointed on the camera? You see, you got it on. You got it on. Actions can be a lie. You think flowers can't be a lie? Flowers? <laughs> you think flowers? 25 pounds on a phone call to some dickhead who delivery dude can't be a lie. Look at this. This some dickhead. <laughs> Why he's so. Bro, this nigga don't have no filter, me. You don't play around, man. Life is calculated. All men lie. It's really not. Men lie because, yeah, life life at the upper echelons, at the highest echelons of life. You don't offer cut up, man. Every single man is the top echelon of life. Hit him with a chopstep, hit him with a chopstep. Boom. I'm already at the top echelon of man. Oh, he's at the top echelon. He already said he's already at the top. It's a calculated process. You don't get there by accident. Nothing good in life happens on accident. What about the, oh, he said nothing in life is happening by accident, right? 
So what if I go to the casino? What if I what if I win the lottery lottery tomorrow? That ain't that ain't that ain't that ain't what? That's a, that's basically <laughs> an accident, but like, I ain't mean to win that. That's just, that was luck, boy. What you talking about, boy, Andrew? And well, I hope you see this clip too. Men don't lie. I gonna lie. I will listen. Nigga. I want him. I want him to like, react to me so bad and say something to me so bad, but so he could go back and forth, boy. Why? Because you believe in actions. <laughs> a lot of actions are lies. Am I high? Look at this. I do think. <laughs> You seem intelligent, you're not stupid. You know, it's so stupid. I'd say you're a high value woman, but your actions dictate that, right? Huh? The most <laughs> important actions a woman can undertake is loyalty. Every man out here knows that disloyalty is the most disgusting thing a female could ever do to her man. But Fox, you Fox, you can't be disloyal. Let's not pretend that male loyalty and female loyalty are the same thing. But loyalty is loyalty. No, but they're not the same thing, are they? Why is it not? Because men and women are not the same. We are not the same. You are correct there. Okay, so we agree. No, but I'm not agreeing to people being dishonest. Cheating. Wait, Tamo, what if Andrew was a girl, boy? <laughs> Why do if he was a girl, they wouldn't be saying the same thing. Children. I'm telling you. you know, we nurture, we're, you know, compassionate, emotional beings. Yep. Men are very different. I agree. However, I don't think it's very fair for men to sit with the opinion that it's acceptable for men to cheat. I didn't even say that. Yeah, that's not an example of it. Yeah, but you can't cheat, boy. As you are. I get you on my whole life. You ain't talking that though. Life hard, bro. <laughs> life hard. <laughs> life hard, bro. Regards cannot be. Life hard for you, daddy. So, but so if I'm with you, these ladies don't know how to stop. Cheat. That's disgusting. I can't believe you even said that on, on YouTube. You just said that on YouTube. <laughs> you said, I'm sorry to the world. Dude, please don't listen to this. Say happens. I'm sorry to the world. No, 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 it doesn't. No, it does. happen. no, 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 no. Please don't say this on YouTube. You're gonna corrupt the youth. I'm sorry for her. I'll pray for her. These things can't be said. Women can't. Do <laughs> Women can't do that. So it's a double standard. It's a double standard. But life is full of double standards. Yeah, but it doesn't mean any like listen. Regardless with your philosophies and everything that you keep. It's not my philosophy. You know, so I'm saying like, ahead, life right? is full of double standards. Correct. I understand that. But in a relationship, she should not be. I can't be no big right. man. You Please, Lord, I can't be. You know, you just yuck that off. You Come here. What I'm saying. When you're when you're so I like. I did. Like, so it was. You two together. Agreed. So why cheat? I know, I understand where you're coming from. My point is that relationships and life is full of double standards as a whole. A man's gonna pay for everything everywhere you go, right? This is this is duty as a man. No cap, but one girl try to pay for something one time. <coughs> I, I give the <laughs> my credit card instead and she still leave me. <laughs> my sick. No, that, I do like traditional. I lie, okay, so we, we, just, right? we just stop so talking about traditional. Let's talk about tradition. Every single man since the dawn He's of human time had more than one. Every single king, every single emperor, every single sultan, every single conqueror since the dawn of human time had more than one woman. All of them. Every single one. Read a history book. Read the Bible. It's all in there. The Quran. All of it. If we're talking about tradition. It's all there. You know, the only reason your mind is different, the only reason you believe differently is because of society. Society is come along and told you something. Yeah, but society, we can change. Like, the world evolves, things change. The world evolves. Yeah, that's right. Now now, now men can cut their dicks off and their chicks. You, really <laughs> you got the f***ing thing? You really <laughs> this crap? It's all I feel like life's about choices. Life is about choices. Correct. My point is this. If I had a woman, I would decide not to cheat because I decide. However, I would not see my infidelity as nearly anywhere near even 1% as disgusting as female infidelity because female infidelity dis involves emotion. You will not and see And they get on the But if you feel like nothing right now, be a different thing. I can be head over heels and love I'm sorry for this, yeah, this young lady. I hope you guys a nigga be. Make sure she has a beautiful family, a nice big house, all of it, and I'll still fuck that bitch. Watch me. Any <laughs> woman won't do that. Say, watch so don't lie to me and pretend. No, you won't. Any woman who will sit here and say, I can f dudes and not care about them is fundamentally broken. Her soul is broken. Okay, well, she's broken then, but she's still doing it. Well, if she's broken, she ain't anywhere near me. I don't want no broken bitch near me. <laughs> I'm definitely You think so? Well, those are the kind of women I will not associate with. Females shouldn't even want to cheat. And the reason women can't cheat is because <laughs> like they're way too want to cheat. <laughs> Where is the girl playing with? Science in and of itself, just because you can now find out who the dad is, doesn't undo 5,000 years of human evolution in which a female had to be loyal to one man so we knew exactly who the father was. If a man has multiple partners, you know who the mother is, you know who the father is. If a woman has multiple partners, nobody knows who the dad is, nobody wants to look after the kid, and a woman with a child without a father or without a man around in the ancient world was toast. He talks a lot of nothing. <laughs> I would never ever be with a true good man. I would never but ever. You can't, you can't, you can't. Yes, I can. Oh, yes, yes, I can. <laughs> yes, I yes, can. can. Of course I can. No, you can't. Like, yes. because the thing is, with you, like, this is just an assumption. I'm assuming, you know, you have a nice this life. Is no, it's but I'm wrong. saying you have a nice life, you live a good lifestyle. Women will just see you as an opportunity. If I was, a, if I was a dumbass, yeah. You lie. You lie. You lie. The thing about it is, like, if you rich, boy. 
I ain't gonna lie, but if you rich, you got like a thousand gals in your DMs, way. But if you's a, Real. if you's an average nigga who making money, nobody going to talk to you. But if you's like and this Andrew and you've a billion dollars, you get like a thousand people in your DMs. One in they trying to go pick him. I telling you, but like. Groups of women also. Like, do you think a high-value woman is going to sit there and tolerate a man condescending and talking to her and being like, we're different and we're this, we're that, because we're not. A woman, you, knows her, a woman that knows her worth is not going to tolerate that. As professionals, we discussed the infidelity of females. And I said that female infidelity is more disgusting than male infidelity. And I think that the world agrees with me. History agrees with me. The Bible agrees with me. The Quran agrees with me. Every you like to say the Bible, but the Bible don't agree with that, man. I tell you, we think he is, bro. Uh, who he think gonna be promoting man cheating, me? <laughs> <laughs> who he, where he get that from, me? You think this a Rossi? All eyes, bro. You think this a Rossi? Wait, what? The females who are promiscuous should either be stoned to death or at least cast out from his life. Female promiscuity is a brand new book. He's trying to kill girls. He's trying to kill girls. <laughs> I'm glad. Why do you ever get married? Listen to me, boy. If I ha wait. If every girl, wait, in my past life, if they used to stone girls who cheat and lie, all my exes would have been dead. Concept. This is <laughs> wait, like all the of them would have been dead. All of them. Be. You would have had a couple bodies, but what? Dead bodies. In GTA, in GTA, you too. In GTA. Why? Because they know deep down that female promiscuity is disgusting. It's revolting. So the whole idea of a female wanting to sleep with more than one man at a time is haram. And they know it inside of their souls, inside of their hearts. I don't think so. As, yes, they do. As does a man. No. Whereas a man, if he sleeps with a bunch of chicks, doesn't matter. Who cares? So would you be with me if I had slept with over 50 men? No. No. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. This thing is a joke of me. Why is it unacceptable? A body count is probably the number one most easiest way to judge the value of a female. I actually think okay. that 19. No, no. No cap. I think you have a point, though. Like. He died. He died. He died. I don't have no bodies, way. No bodies, way. Damn. Wait, if a girl have one body. And we talking? I can date you, bro. You need to have zero bodies, dog. Like, no, 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 no. I'm gonna say, damn, this. man. I think 99% of the world's problems, and no one's gonna understand this, but if you can extrapolate, if you can listen to this statement and extrapolate it out towards society at large, I think 99% of the world's problems would be solved if females walked through life with their body count on their forehead. <laughs> <laughs> Like, what are you Wait, doing? that's like holding the L sign on top of your head, but that's like holding the number 16 to 25 to 85 on your head, bro. Like, what? Because, it would, prevent, on because your head. it would prevent all of the disintegration of morals. Anyway, but I can end the video here, but we can, we can, we can yeah. react, I mean, yeah, we can react to some more later, but how much, how much likes for part two, really? Yeah. Pardon me? I say, how much likes for part two? <clears throat> I probably won't get um what fifteen on it. Behind that big baby. Behind that big baby. He's like fifteen on it. Seventeen on it then. Seventeen. I mean seventeen. You going up, but you slow it. Right? No way. One good hundred. hundred. Seven thousand. Seven thousand. Seven. One good hundred. One good hundred life up part two, bro. You you bugging. You're bugging. I'm not that big, but only have two K, but you're bugging. You're bugging, baby. You're bugging. You're bugging. Anyway, yeah. Yeah, 100, 100 likes for part two. One million likes, boy. What you mean, by One million likes. One million likes for the next bit. <laughs> I'm playing with that.